Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am finally bringing you another chips and dip video. You guys have been asking for this, so you shall receive. <laughs> so, I'm very excited for the dips today. This one is a cheese pimento dip. Uh, the recipe that I followed, I'll just link below, I just veganized it. But it's basically like a cheesy dip. It actually doesn't require to be cooked. I just wanted to put it in a skillet because I love the aesthetic of a skillet. So yeah, this is just vegan cream cheese, vegan mayo, vegan cheese, pimentos, a bunch of spices, hot sauce, and then the recipe calls for chives on top, but I don't have any, so I just put in dried parsley. And then this is kind of an amalgamation of different recipes. I'll write what I did down below, but it's basically supposed to be a Mississippi mud pie dip. But I made a bunch of alterations and I made it more of like a peanut butter mud pie. I don't know. It called for Oreos and I didn't have regular Oreos. I just had peanut butter pie Oreos, so I used those. Anyway, I'll write what I did down below. And then also for today, I'm playing Would You Rather because it's been so long and I love playing Would You Rather. Oh, and the chips for this dip... This isn't sponsored, but they're all from Trader Joe's, okay? Trader Joe's just has the best everything. So we have these sea salted satel potato crisps. I've had these before, they're pretty good. Then of course they're rolled corn tortilla chips. These are better than Takis in my opinion. And then, I've actually tried these before too, but these are their white truffle potato chips, which are accidentally vegan, and they're so good. They remind me of the truffle mac and cheese I had from Down to Earth. If you haven't seen that video, go watch it because oh, so good. And then for the sweet dip, I have vegan graham crackers and double stuffed nutter butters, which I've actually never had before to go with the peanut butter mud pie theme. Anyway, very excited. Dessert first. I'm gonna start with the graham crackers. Okay. Oh yeah, and then there's also vegan marshmallows and pecans on top. <gasps> uh oh. It's very thick. Oh, it just broke. Whoa. It's so thick. That hurt my feelings. It tastes just like a brownie. This is so good. I wish I added more vegan marshmallows to it. I love the texture of them with this. It's just like a perfect chewiness to it.
Alright, let's try the Nutter Butters in it. These don't look double stuff. Oh well. Ooh, these are perfect. Well, I was going to say they're perfect because they're sturdy, but never mind. You failed me. Mmm. So, there's not really a peanut buttery vibe, even though I added the peanut butter pie Oreos. But this adds the peanut buttery aspect to it. It's good, but I prefer the graham crackers. Alright. Oh yeah, and then I just asked you guys on the YouTube community tab for some would you rather questions. So that's what I'm pulling from. Alright, Santiago Hardy 2728 asked, Would you rather live in a stunning home, everything state of the art, all free limitless food? Utilities paid, no expenses at all, none, but the house is either one mile above the surface of the earth or one mile beneath the surface of the earth. I wouldn't mind it being one mile beneath the surface of the earth. I mean, that's pretty far down, but I feel like that's safe. If you guys didn't see my doomsday conspiracy theory video, I talked about how all these famous and rich people are getting bunkers. So, I mean, if I have the state-of-the-art utilities paid free food house but it was a mile underground I would not be complaining because it's a bunker and it couldn't keep me safe from potential end of the world jasmine underscore 196 asked would you rather eat sweet food for the rest of your life or savory food I've gotten this question before definitely sweet because I just can't live without chocolate or acai bowls and she also asked, would you rather know how you were going to die or when you were going to die? And I've also gotten that one before, but I've kind of thought about it a little bit more. If I know when I'm going to die, then I can just live my life to the fullest up until that day. But if I know how I'm going to die, then I'm just going to try and stay away from whatever it is. Like, let's say I figure out that I'm going to die in a fire then I'm going to stay away from any form of fire that I can, which means I wouldn't be in the kitchen anymore, and I wouldn't have all my candles anymore, you know what I mean? Like, it just, I feel like I would just be dreading everything. But knowing when I die, like I said, knowing that date, I can live my life to the fullest and get everything done that I want to up until that date. So yeah, now I'm going to try this dip, and I'm going to start with the potato crisps, just because I feel like... These will give me a good base flavor. Ooh. That is so good. I added extra hot sauce. You barely even notice it. It's so good. The flavors. Not too spicy, super creamy and garlicky. Wow. I think I like this one more than that one. This is really good.
I was going to bring a Zevia to drink, but I need to drink more water and I'm trying to do better drinking more water, especially because it's summer now. So I'm drinking water. Okay. Now I'm going to try some of the white truffle potato chips in it. That's strangely a really good combo. Not the best chips for dipping though. I lost like half my chips in there. Yeah, these aren't the best for dipping just because they're so delicate, but delicious. I love these chips. Oh, they're so good on their own. They almost have like a smoky flavor. Just delicious. Divine. Delightful. Exquisite. It's Kristen underscore seven asked, would you rather eat peanut butter for your whole life or eat baked beans for your whole life? I love baked beans. You guys know me. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. So peanut butter. Sawyer underscore Leon 911 asked, would you rather only eat your favorite food or your favorite dessert for the rest of your life? Does acai count as food or is it a dessert? But dessert is food to me. I'll just pick food and I'll pick acai because I swear I could eat acai for the rest of my life. Alan Casino Fun asked, would you rather go on a road trip without any snacks or drinks? This one's kind of easy for me because when I'm on a road trip, I don't really drink anyway because I swear I have the smallest bladder known to mankind. And so I always have to pee even if I drink the tiniest bit. So I never drink on road trips, which is bad. And I that's why I don't really like road trips necessarily or long drives. So no drinks. I think I'll just stick with that for now all right and then last but not least the Trader Joe's version of Takis the last time I had these in a dip it was a corn dip and it was so good come on Honestly, it kind of just tastes like I'm eating the dip with a spoon because the Takis have a similar flavor to the dip. They kind of have like that same spice. So it's good, but like it just tastes like I'm eating the dip with a spoon. With a little bit extra spice. I think my favorite are the truffle chips in it. I love the combination of flavors. My camera cut me off. 
at the worst time. So rude. Pimento. Milo2002 asked, would you rather move to a country with a completely different language, can't move for at least three years, or stay in your current country and never be able to leave it, even for visiting? Honestly, move to a country with a completely different language, because that would actually give me motivation and discipline to learn another language. But also, I can't just not, not visit other places. That just is so sad to me. I would probably move to France, yeah. <laughs> Flash of the Blades asked, would you rather spend a night in a haunted house or give up your phone for a month? I wouldn't mind giving up my phone for a month other than the fact that I use it for you guys and my YouTube videos, but I can also do that on my laptop. But also, like, I've always just wanted to spend a night in a haunted house, so i just do that anyway. <laughs> Alright, Naba underscore Ramin86 asked, would you rather watch a movie at home or at a cinema? Honestly, at home, I love the aesthetic of a cinema, and I think it's fun if you're with a group of friends or with family or whatever, but I just love the comfort of being home. I don't know, it's just more comfortable, plus it's my home, and where my TV is, it's right next to my kitchen, so I can get whatever food that I want. Just saying. Okay, moving back to the sweet dip. Don't break, please. Yeah. Mm hmm I really like the texture of the marshmallows with it.
Ooh, this is a good one. Hearts for Zab asked, would you rather have a chance to speak with your younger self or older self? Honestly, probably my younger self. Just to tell her that she's enough and she doesn't need to worry about what other people think of her. And that, at least that life will get better. Yeah. Monty222 asked, would you rather cut your hair really short or dye it black? Definitely dye it black because I want to keep the length of my hair. It has taken me too long. It's taken me almost six years to get this length. So, I'm going to keep that. Oh, this one's so hard. Calamity Jane 5484 asked, would you rather do without Halloween or Christmas? Those are my two favorite holidays, but if I'm going to pick one, I'm going to go without Halloween. Because Christmas, number one, brings families together more than Halloween does. But two, there's just this feeling of joy and peace that comes with Christmas. I get to be with my family, like, and just the meaning behind it all. Christmas. I love Christmas. I'm going to have a few more bites of this, but finish it off with this. I typically like to end it with dessert, but this is just too good. I probably have chocolate all up in my teeth. It's so stretchy. The Nutter Butter package was hitting my leg and it freaked me out for a second. I was like, what is it? Just Nutter Butters. Mm. I'm eating these, by the way. They're just so good. I just realized I didn't give you a close-up shot of this. I mean, it's not much to look at, but it tastes amazing.
All right, I'm going to answer a few more questions. X Zero Rin asked, would you rather stub your toe or hit your funny bone? I have very sensitive feet, so I would probably rather hit my funny bone. Okay, this is going to be the last one. Lol-PR3IJ asked, would you rather give up peanut butter forever or being vegan? Honestly, I'd probably give up peanut butter because I don't want to eat meat. I don't want to eat eggs or dairy. Ugh. Yeah, so I think I would actually give up peanut butter, which is terrible, but I'm not eating meat. Thank you guys for all of your questions. I'm sorry if I didn't get to yours. Hopefully next time. All right. The last bite. Hmm. Alright you guys, that is the end of today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. Thank you again for all of your questions. I love you guys so much. I always have so much fun doing videos like this and involving you guys, so thank you for participating. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and if you want to see more, and don't forget to subscribe. By the way, it's free. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!